We're back. Who here likes to edit strangers out of their photos? <laughs> oh, more than I thought. So a writer for Slate makes the case for leaving them in, arguing that you miss the whole story when you erase things in the background. So do you lose something when you edit people out? I, I, yeah, oh, you, no, no, you, you okay. go, you go. I think for candidates, Yes, I think if you're on the beach and you're having a nice time, you're just snapping pics and you take away the background, like, do, are people gonna believe you're alone on the beach? No. Yeah. So um, yeah. then, but if you're doing like a family photo shoot, I'll let the photographer use their eye and do whatever they want. But then I was thinking about it with my husband and I was thinking that like, that if you just, if you left people in there, you could help with crime cases. This is the thing, <laughs> you're not wrong. Yeah. Well, yeah. There are, all, there are that? stories yeah. of yeah. murderers being found or being yeah. found out via the stranger. I'm kidding. Where are you guys taking these photos? Where are you traveling? What is beaches. happening? We are. We're going to crime we are. It is important. Like, yeah. and that, that is like a legitimate concern. There's also like, you know, the story that we're missing is true, as this article yeah. points out. Like, there's that famous photo, which we can't show because of copyright, but you'll all know what I'm talking about. It's the sailor's kiss. It's like yes. when the sailors yes. come home from the wartime, yes. right? Yeah. New York City. They come, he comes in and he grabs a girl. We, everyone thought of it as, as the most romantic moment in the world, overtaken by passion. Mm -hmm. Turns out, first of all, that woman did not give her consent at all. She was like, what, who is this? And that guy's girlfriend is in the background of that shot. She's standing there being like, what, what the heck? So again, the story that we're yes. missing. And I'll just say, this is as a side note. Mm. There are young kids today who will never know the awkward joy of photos that we had to wait for, and they yeah. just, no matter what, if someone's head was cropped off, if you looked yep. terrible, they just went in the album. Yeah. I have an example. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> and not only is there this photo of this awkward, sweaty moment as a teen, there's another one that oh. went in the photo album. And I'm Both. just saying, Both. bless, we need more of these terrible yeah. photos out in the world. Stop over editing. I want to trash can those two photos so badly. <laughs> <laughs> Leave them all in. No, you know what? I'm not a fan of this. I don't think the kids are missing out on anything. I think it was like, because back in the day when you only had a finite amount of pictures you can take on that camera, and then you had to wait a week or two weeks so you could find out which pictures worked, and if it was all bad, you missed the whole birthday party. Were we really missing out on something? Yes! No, no, no. The flavor, I, the flavor of what's around you. That flavor is paprika. It's not great. <laughs> it's nobody cares. Um, no, I love that we can do it now, and maybe because I have very high maintenance girlfriends, maybe some of you can attest to this, where when we take pictures, it's like, when she says take a picture of me, what she's really saying is take a thousand pictures oh, of me. Yeah. I, I want you to that. get, I want you to get low. I want you to get me from up top. I want you to get the whole outfit. And then we have to go back and we have to edit and assess. Yes, no, I don't like that one. Take it again, I want. So, and then at the end, you get to crop and, and do everything that you want to the picture. I enjoy that, everybody's happy. The only thing I would like, never mind getting rid of strangers. How about the people that you no longer date or no longer speak to? <laughs> and doing a little eek -a, eek -a, eek -a, and get them out of the picture. That's what it's, forget the strangers, it's the ex-boyfriend you want to get out of that picture. Yeah, <laughs> thousand percent. I think that with the dawn of smartphones, we all became pseudo-professional oh, yeah. photographers. And you now have the option of taking a thousand pictures. And to be honest, like when, you know, I travel and I get, um, not through my phone, but I get professional photo shoots done when I travel to capture the idea. moment. I don't want to be distracted by the, the nobody in the background that means nothing. I want a photo, everything has to be like wall worthy. Have I put any of them on my walls? No. <laughs> but I have to look at it and I want it to be wall worth. And that doesn't mean I'm sanitizing her history or my daughter's history. Yeah. But I do think like I, right now I have 50,000 photos in my camera yeah, roll. Yeah. And I know they're not perfect. And it's the fun now just going through them like this. Well, I'm never going to solve there. a murder if you yeah, don't <laughs> Surveillance Society. They are, they're on a camera somewhere doing the murder. Yeah. Uh, we're helping with alibis here. Thank and you. People are getting to live their lives freely. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We've got lots more discussion and debates on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. Don't forget to click like and subscribe.